Hey everybody, Chaos Argate here, and welcome back to more Let's Play Trauma Team. Ah, I've missed you guys. I haven't been in, on here in like two, three weeks now. I am really sorry about that. Anyways, I've been enjoying my little impromptu break. I've played like Sonic Colors, GoldenEye. They're they're pretty cool. They're awesome. But well, let's get back, uh, let's get down to business. I know why you're here. You're here to watch me complete this mission and whatever else is left in Trauma Team. Let's do it! Last time we were pretty much done with the di diagnosis. We just had to put blood spots on the left admin to acute pancre pancreatitis, whatever. I can't pronounce it today, I don't know why. Diagnose complete! Ta-da! Pancreatitis. Oh, pancreatitis. Thank you, Dr. Cunningham. I find it hard to believe this could have caused the relapse of his gastric ulcers. Damn it. There's still something else. Roni, I'm continuing with the diagnosis. I'm not done yet. Of course. I will follow your lead. Not like you can do anything else, Roni. Eh, why don't we get the pancreatitis? That can't be the primary disease. Why don't we get the cool uh conference music? The chief illness caused it. Like the ulcers. Uh, what the heck's going on? We can only hope our examination will answer that, Doctor. <sighs> yeah. I hate dealing with all these complications. Don't we all? Let's do this. Diagnosis phase three. Um. So, have you figured out what's wrong with me, Doctor? It's going to take a little longer. We need to keep examining you. But is your body alright? It still hurts a little. But you're gonna fix me soon, right? You know, I always find it weird when patients ask their doctors to fix them. It's like, they're, it's like they think they're machines and that all you need to do is like, turn a few bolts, replace a few parts. No. That's you... right. Hang in there. I don't know. But if it gets too much to handle, you tell us right away, okay? I don't know, I thought make me feel better or just heal me would be more appropriate, but... Okay, I promise. I won't question All it. Right. Let's resume with the diagnosis. Uh, let's start with the diagnostic. See if anything's changed. Okay, this is fine, yup. Uh-huh, okay, yeah, alright, uh-huh. Mm-hmm, okay, yeah. It's okay. You know what, this looks okay. We already have this. This went over. Huh. His blood calcium is way past the average levels. Roni, you got that one? Oh, the enzymes here just reminded me I have bio homework. Ah. New symptom observed. High blood calcium level. It's not that I don't like. It's not that I don't hate AP bio or don't like it. Whatever. Just. Yeah. I don't know. I just. Yeah. Serum phosphorus level is abnormally low. Roni, another piece of the puzzle. Understood, Doctor. New symptom observed. Low serum phosphorus level. Whatever, this isn't the, the place to complain about my AP Bio homework. This is the place to examine Joshua Cunningham. Yep. Abnormally high PRL blood level. Roni, mark it down. Understood, Doctor. New symptom observed. High PRL blood level. Uh, I really don't remember. Did these change since last time? It's, whoa! Oh, wait, we already have that one. But this one went over, too. Ooh. Hmm. The serum gastrin level seems unusually high. Roni, record that. Understood, Doctor. New symptom observed. High serum gastrin level. Okay, uh, are we all good down here? Yes, we are. Oh, no, we're not. His intact PTH is showing some very high levels. Roni, put it very, in the Very, very high. Come on, that's five times higher than what it should be. At least five. Actually, it's over five times what it should be. What in the heck? The number of 
of abnormal levels have suddenly appeared. I would have made note of that a little earlier. The cause is unknown, but the analysis is at least 97% reliable. Let's just say it's reliable then. No, that's why I'm worried. Let's go back to my office. I need to sort through the latest data. We don't even need to question him? Really? Yeah, no, I'll do it anyways. Anything else that's weird? Um... Uh, uh, I'm not hiding anything anymore. Um... I started getting real thirsty. I've been going to the bathroom a lot, too. Let's take this. I see. This is polydipsia and polyuria. How do you know these off the top of your head? Wait, no, never mind, it's Gabriel. He knows a lot. It's small, but it's crucial. Roni, make a note. Understood, Doctor. New symptom observed. Polydipsia and polyuria. Uh, that's it. Is that important? It's <laughs> kind of embarrassing. Well, you are talking to a doctor, so... To the office! to narrow down our candidates and see if we can't find the culprit. Okay. Uh, I already know which one this is. This one is not here. Uh, I don't think it's acute kidney failure. Hyper para parathyroidism. Okay. All right. Yeah, I probably should read this. I should really read this. That's all that matches up, right? Low serum phosphate. A number of symptoms which don't apply, but hyperparathyroidism seems to be the closest match, right? Mm-hmm. Examinations will be necessary to make a definitive diagnosis. Wait, wait. If those were, shouldn't you have pulled up a, a few others? Um, you know, like other diagnoses. You know, because we have all these symptoms. Well, then let's get approval right away. Understood, Doctor. Request has been approved. The X-ray and scintigraphy exams are now available. Uh, okay. I mean, you, pull, you pulled up the uh, acute kidney failure, and that had a bunch of symptoms that don't really match up. Doctor, the x ray and scintigraphy results are ready for your review. Sounds Yay. good. Yay. Let's get to it then. Pixel hunting. Sonic Colors never made me pixel hunt. Is there. Wait. wait. Why are we looking at the these fingers again? Wait a minute. What's up? The bones in his fingers have gotten thinner. His bone resorption must be advancing. That isn't good. Brony, add this to our list. Understood, Doctor. New symptom observed. Subperiosteal bone resorption. And let's take a look at the skintigraphy. Whoa! I don't even want to take a look at the, the, the original. I already can look, see that there's something wrong here. It's showing abnormal accumulation of technetium in the parathyroid gland. There's no mistaking it. That's parathyroid adenoma. Understood, Doctor. New symptom observed. Parathyroid adenoma. Okay. I think that's all we can get from this. So let's go back and make a diagnosis. Oops! Joshua, are you alright? You have to tell us if it gets too much for you. Oh, Doctor! I'm gonna try my best to help. I see. Please do. You're one brave kid, but you promise that you won't overstrain yourself, okay? At least he's cooperative. Unlike frickin' Jacob Tillman! Frickin' old geezer. To the office! Unless we weren't done. Let's see. Uh, hyper parent. And it's 
There we go. That hyperparathyroidism has set in. But what about the symptoms that don't apply? Doctor, until the primary disease has been identified, we must continue the diagnosis. Yeah, no turning back now. We need to figure this thing out. Yes. But what do we do? Do we go back to Joshua now? Yup. To the exam room! I don't see why we have to go use this door to go over to this way. Joshua, are you alright? Huh? Oh, when did you come in, Doctor? You? Didn't notice? Did you not hear the door open? Uh, something's weird. It's like I can't see very well. But did you hear the door open? Can't see very well? Can you tell me more? Uh-huh. Okay. Question! I really didn't see you come in, Doctor. I mean, it's weird, right? The door's right there. You should have heard it! That, that's what I'm concerned about. Wait, what? But Why not? I totally didn't see when you came in. And my head hurts too. But I'll keep trying to help you, Doctor. Doubt everything. The evidence supports the truth. That sounds like something that should be said in Ace Attorney. Stomach aches, back pains, now headaches. This has to be hard on him. I need to find the answer quickly. New symptom observed. Headaches. Do I? I, I, I don't know if I want to risk this one. Doubt everything. The evidence supports the truth. Aha! He must be undergoing a visual field loss. Joshua, where is it hard to see? Is it the right and left edges of your eyes? Huh? Oh, um, I think so. I can't see right and left. Oh no! He's getting tunnel vision! Well, if he ever needs a job, he can go apply at Outer Heaven. The guards there are... Um, they're looking for guards who have tunnel vision. Just as I thought. It could be in the eyes. It could be in the brain. We need to do an MRI. Ah. Visual field loss. And the MRI exam is now available. Oh, I think we're done. Okay, well, I think this is a good place to end off the episode. Next time on Let's Play Trauma Team, we're gonna go... We're gonna go check out that MRI exam. And hopefully not screw up, like we've been doing for that one questioning. Until then, though, bye.